Hello, everyone. Welcome to our review of Anger Foot from Free Lives and Devolver Digital. According to the Steam page, Anger Foot is a lightning fast, hard bass blast of kicking doors and kicking ass. However, I define it as a first person hotline Miami mixed with high on life. As you immerse yourself in the adrenaline pumping, caffeine fueled chaos of shit city, you'll harness the power of your lethal feet to take down a diverse array of ruthless gangsters, with each encounter more challenging than the last. As you Navigate through the gritty slums, sewers, and towering skyscrapers, the protagonist, an unassuming man with an extraordinary ability to kick doors and enemies with unparalleled force, is on a mission to cleanse the city of its criminal elements. As you kick more ass, you'll discover new weapons and unlock powerful sneakers along the way. At the time of this review, there are 23 different sneakers you can unlock and use. It's really hard to talk about what the game is other than just a non-stop slaughter of putting on different types of sneakers and kicking ass with a few other weapons in between. Okay, maybe saying kicking ass this much in a review isn't the best. Regarding accessibility settings, there is a decent amount. The game includes an assist mode, which allows players to adjust the difficulty to make it more manageable. For players who want to focus on purely on the thrill of the action without worrying about in-game death, there is also never die mode. With this mode enabled, players can dive into the chaos and enjoy an uninterrupted spree of kicking ass all day long. It's an ideal setting for those who want to explore the game at their own pace, experiment with different strategies, or simply revel in the sheer fun of invincibility. Another helpful setting is the weapon highlight setting, which ensures that players never miss when a new weapon drops. This is particularly useful in the heat of battle when the action is intense and quick reflexes are essential. With weapons highlighted, players can easily spot and switch to new gear, maintaining their edge in combat without the frustration of missing crucial pickups. Anger Foot also includes a variety of settings to enhance visual comfort and accessibility. For players who are sensitive to intense visual effects, options like no blood mode and the ability to disable flashing lights provide a more comfortable gaming experience. Additionally, the game offers settings for auto-aim helping players who might struggle with precise aiming to enjoy the game without hindrance. To recap, Anger Foot is a lightning fast, hard bass blast of kicking doors and kicking ass. However, to me, I define it as a first-person hotline Miami mixed with high on life. The game is chaotic, but in a good way. While the game is great for a good laugh, that's about all the value I get out of it. And to me, the game seems a little overpriced for the amount of time I spent playing it once. And for a game, I'm likely to just casually pick up again to kick ass. At Rectify Gaming, we score Anger Foot a 6.5 out of 10. This review was written by FNC Will and voiced by Tyboy17. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you guys next time.